basically, if you have a, a product based on NR52 series today, you should really, really look at, can I switch to the NR54L series and then I can get all these improvements. I can, bet, I can use a smaller battery. Yes. I can put in yes. more functionality. So this is the NR54L series. And uh, this is something we recently introduced and it's basically taking the NR52 series to the next level. It's uh, all the same good stuff that you all know and love, but it's just improved in every way. Um, it has more powerful uh, MCU functionality, twice the processing power, three twice, X, twice, twice, and three X the processing efficiency. Right, and then a new ultra low power radio. I'm stressing that because he told me before the interview that he's going to tell me something. So there's a reason. Twice, three times. Yeah, go. And uh, you have a new ultra low power. Uh, multi-protocol radio in there, um, much lower power consumption, more efficient as well. So you've improved the you've improved the radio. Yeah. So it's even going lower power. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So twice, three times, even better radio. Yeah. Okay. Good. Yeah. Keep going. Yeah. Um, and then we decided that we wanted to create like a demo where we can actually show these things live because we want it to be, we want to provide proof. Yeah. Tangible proof so that it's not just numbers uh, on a web page somewhere, but you can actually see it here live, uh, these things that we're claiming. Um, and then we can switch over to the demo, maybe. Let's do it. Yeah. That's why we're here. Yeah. So here we have like uh, a challenge between the NR52 series and the NR54L series. So it's a direct comparison. Yeah. And we're. Uh, they even use the word versus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And we're measuring. Uh, the current conception of each of these and showing it live on the screen. So yeah. At the top you have 52 series and then you have the... So emphasizing how you've improved the low power. Yeah. Right. Uh, and then we can uh, check out um, this state first, which is Bluetooth Low Energy Advertising, which we'll is show, something... We'll, we'll show you on the screen, but this says Bluetooth LE Advertising. Okay? Yeah. And this is uh, something that all Bluetooth Low Energy products need to do to connect, obviously, so it's uh, quite important. And if you look at the average current consumption here, you can see that this is basically like two thirds. Yep, 265 yeah. versus yeah. 173. Yeah. Uh, and then we can switch to connection, which is what you do. Yep. Yeah. Done advertising, and then you connect. And then uh, you can, we can compare the current consumption there as well. Yep. Well, that's nearly... You just uh, need to complete the yeah, whole yeah, 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 yeah. so that we yeah. can see the average. We'll, can see... We'll, we'll do a screenshot, but that's approximately half. Yeah. Approximately half. Yeah. Not quite. Two thirds. Yeah. Two thirds. Let's... Two thirds. Sorry. Let's two thirds. Accurate. <laughs> two thirds. Yeah. yeah. And then uh, in the last uh, here, we are uh, doing uh, one million, uh, solving one million quadratic uh, equations. Uh, one million a... quadratic equations. Yeah. It's easy for you to say. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can see here that, so this is like uh, the amount of time it takes to process this. Yes, and you that's can see all about that time. And if you, do, if you do something, I take it if you do things quicker, you use it, you use less power. Exactly. So you, so you do it quicker. So this is like the 2x processing power, yep. right, uh, that I mentioned. That's the 2x uh, bit. Yeah. You do it quicker, but you can also do more on one processor, right? Right, yes. Uh, and then if you then look at the average, you can see that it's... Uh, you know, I mentioned half and then got corrected to two thirds. Yeah. This is half. <laughs> this is actually less than half. Less than half. Yeah, it's like 30%. Yeah. One third, I would say. Yeah. yeah. Yes, you're right. Uh, it's one third. Yeah. So there you have like the 3x processing efficiency from right. that number. Right. Yeah. So, I mean, on, on every level, this is outperforming what you had. So, so the NR52, this is outperforming Substantially, substantially. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Good. Right. So, 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 so basically, if you have a, a product based on an NR52 series today, you should li really, really look at: Can I switch to the NR54L series, and then I can get all these improvements? I can bet. I can use a smaller battery. Yes. I can put in yeah. more functionality. Yeah. Yeah. So, and it's, the it's a lot why, of value in here. The reason yeah. why we went through all these facts and figures was because you you produced this chip. You sell two million of these a day. It's pretty insane. Two million of these a day. Yeah. Um, and now you're offering this upgrade two times, three times, all those all those powerful qualities. Obviously, the big question is, yeah, but that's going to cost me more. It is, they have a similar uh, similar price. Okay, you have a lot of more value. 
yes. uh, in this in this product. Yes. So if you're starting a new design today, no. using needing ultra low power processing power with all the things that we've just showed you today. I need to start a project. Naturally, I thought I'd evaluate that, but what you should actually do is go and get yourself a board and yeah. plug that in and go and have a look at that. Yeah, and you still get like the things that the, that is really great about this, the product yeah. quality, reliability, the tech support is obviously the same. Yes. We're going to help you solve your problems. Yes, you can remember what, you get help from Remember us, what so. they said, the first two things yeah. were nothing to do with technology. No. They were to do with reliability and customer service. That's very interesting. Yeah. So, okay, that's a brilliant introduction. Thank you. Thank you. Good.